Here we have the Pedal PCB Duocast project. It's a clone of the uh, Hudson Broadcast. Uh, real quick, um, just shout out. A guy named Clemens Winkler was the guy who actually discovered germanium. And so that's why I named it the Winkler Preamp. Um, it's the Hudson Broadcast Class A Germanium Preamp is what the official name of it is. So just kind of played on that a little bit. But a great sounding overdrive pedal. I was shocked. Um, I'm not one to normally believe the hype. I think these things go for like $350, $400. Um, no way I would pay for that. Um, but I would, however, pay $100 for a clone. And so that's what I've created here is a clone using the Pedal PCB, uh, their project. Great project. Shout out to them. I'm really pleased with the way this one turned out. Um, so here it is. My bass tone is a Nash T63 with uh, Lawler pickups in it going into my HX Stomp with the Deluxe Reverb Amp uh, attached and a tiny bit of reverb just to, to warm it up a bit. So here's my bass tone. Um, gain is kind of halfway up, so we'll, we'll dial that down just a little bit um, when we first start out. So. Pretty cool little pedal here. Um, so this first stage right here is just the bypass on and off. Um, over here on the left hand side and that's controlling the gain of the uh, or the low gain mode I should say so we've got that right there uh, typical gain and we've got level um, as far as on on the low gain mode and so here's here's that tone this knob to the left is an actual low cut and so it works kind of um, in in a true in a true rotation i guess so the more you turn to the right basically the higher the number goes up the more low frequency you are cutting out so here we'll have it at noon right here just rolls off that low frequency if we back it off all the way we're we are disabling that low cut so we're no longer cutting anything out so nice and full So uh, I like a little more low frequency, especially playing a Telecaster. They're kind of bright and shiny. Um, so we'll we'll go ahead and dial that low cut back some. So that's um, the level controls um, the low gain mode over here. This this bypass switch here. Um, so we've got definite change in volume. Take it down some and crank up the the gain. One of the things with using these old style um, Bakelite knobs is they sometimes play bumper cars with each other. So you may have to move those out of the way in order to get the dialed in specifications. Then we've got, um, this is the high gain mode. It's got its own level control over here on the right hand side. So this is level two for the high gain mode. So we'll go, um, Start off without the pedal engaged. Sorry about shaking the camera there. dynamics of this pedal also just by the way that I'm picking um, so this is uh, the um, the high gain mode it's almost kind of like two pedals in one uh, with the pedal just engaged you've got that bass tone that you could definitely live with 
and then for maybe like a lead boost or adding on that second stage. Uh, this switch here takes it from 9 volts to 27 volts. Um, there's an actual a little mini transformer inside this guy, so you can hear um, it'll take a little bit for like kind of a split second for it to recover. <laughs> But overall, uh, really pleased with this pedal. Um, I wouldn't hesitate to run one of these on my on my rig. Uh, this one is spoken for. I built it for a guy. Um, but um, I guess let it be known, uh, 100 bucks, I can build you a, um, a Hudson Broadcast clone. Uh, not too bad. Typical kind of the, the BB enclosure. So not, not terribly huge, uh, but still um, bigger than your normal size pedal. But um, Winkler preamp, uh, a clone of the Hudson Broadcast. The uh, Pedal PCB Duocast Project.